Hey everyone, Aldeba here. Here I'll be showing a short tutorial on creating custom modifier keys. As you can see here, I'm attacking the dummy. Okay. Now I have over here a whole bunch of attacks I would like to use. So I put them in line underneath my WASD keys where I use for movement. I add in line ZX, C, V, and B, who I cycle through to attack. I just click them in sequence. Now, the problem is I'm playing a character who's very heavy on special action boosts, and I run out of space. So, I've moved some up to the next line, and I've added a modifier. In this case, it's control. So, I can use control plus one of these special attacks. There's one big problem with all of this. The problem is that using control is inconvenient, since I would like to use my left finger, my pinky, on the A, rather than put it down to the control. So I'm going to show you how to make a new modifier. You open up your option tabs, you should have the option of key mapping. Inside of key mapping, right at the beginning, there's something called modifier key. If you click on this, you can add a button to use as a modifier. So in my case, I'm going to use one of my mouse buttons. I have a left and right mouse button and two extra buttons on the left that are like a forward and backwards button. So adding this, we'll add this special button. In this case, can be called button three. Now it can go down to the same exact line that I had before, who was here. Shortcut bar three. This is mine, shortcut bar three. I would like to add these with a modifier. So starting from the first one, shortcut bar three, click on it. I'm going to add my modifier plus Z. So now I have button 3 plus Z. Then I'll move to the next one. And with that, I've added basically a whole new list of modifiers, all using the modifier key on my shortcut bar, on my mouse. So basically now, if in the middle of attacking, I would like to suddenly move to one of the other things, all I do is hold down the special key, and it will use that special attack. Anyway, this is a way to get much more mileage out of the same amount of shortcuts with a simple button you can add on. Anyways, if you've enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Thank you.